Hiya fishy folks and welcome back to Michael's Fish Room. Today, I need help. Grab yourself a healthy snack and beverage. Stand by. All right, fishy folks, here's what I need help with. My 55 gallon planted tank. I'm frustrated. I wanna start over, I think, but I need your help. Here's what's up. All right, fishy folks, uh, here's what I'm talking about. My 55 gallon planted tank. Uh, it's got a couple angels in it, uh, some Colombian tetras, some neon, some black neons. Uh, it's got a bunch of little quarries and a couple plecos that always like to hide. My problem is uh, I'm very, very frustrated and I need help because I'm not a plant expert. I'm not an algae expert. Um, I know just enough to usually make things work, but uh, it looks like my heater over there is filled with water or at least has condensation in it because I haven't been paying attention to this tank. Um, so here we go. We get the brown algae on the glass that comes back within days of me cleaning it off. We've got the black beard algae, which uh, at one point I got rid of using uh, hydrogen peroxide, but it came back. Um, and plants just aren't growing great. Um, and I've tried multiple things to get rid of the algae and maintain the plants. I've tried changing the photo period. I've changed, I've tried not dosing liquid fertilizer, only dosing liquid fertilizer, uh, not dosing uh, fertilizer in the substrate, only dosing fertilizer in the substrate, not dosing any fertilizer. Um, I've changed foods. I've changed water change schedules. I can't seem to get rid of this algae. So I'm simply asking for help. What can I do to get rid of the algae? If I have to start over with plants, I will start over with plants. Uh, that's not much of an issue, but if I don't have to start over with plants, obviously I like to keep what I have and help them grow better, stronger, more green and lush. Uh, so what are your ideas? What should I do? Leave them down in the comments below. And uh, whichever idea I go with, I will make a video on, and then I will uh, show you the progress. Um, just a better idea of what's in the tank. I'll give you another view here. Many plants, many fish. Uh, water parameters are zero, zero, I don't know, five or 10 at best. Uh, the plants really do a decent job of cleaning up the nitrates. <clears throat> if I have to test for phosphates or anything else, let me know. I will go ahead and buy a test. Uh, but you can see this blackbird algae, uh, I mean, it's taken over that filter. I probably need to take that filter out and uh, put a new one in there with a new airline and see if that helps. And I got to check out what's going on with that heater. I just realized that, so... Um, as far as fertilizers, I have Thrive Caps and Thrive Liquid. I also found some Flourish Advance, which I was going to consider using uh, to kill the algae, but I haven't really gotten that far as far as my research goes. So I'm hoping you guys, who are much smarter than me, can help me. Thanks, folks. Have a great day. Hiya fishy folks and welcome back to Michael's Fish Room. Today, my dog would like to be in the video. Look, look, say hi. Hi, Andy. Yeah, he's about 17 years old, Jack Russell Terrier. All right, let's do this again. No matter how many times I kill the black beard algae, the black beard algae, oh, that's just Indy drinking. We'll just wait. Go ahead, buddy.